I've been drinking tea and using nicotine for 52 years. They are mild stimulants and a pleasant part of my day. But apparently nicotine is highly addictive. Really? A mild stimulant with no euphoria, no intoxication, highly addictive? It doesn't make sense. That's because it isn't true. Nicotine is not addictive and after 52 years I should know. If I can't drink tea or use nicotine it's no big deal. I miss them but there's no craving. Unlike when I was a smoker. One hour without a smoke, uncomfortable. Two hours, torture. Three hours and I'd do anything to get a smoke. That's the craving of an addict. Do you remember that early study when smokers were asked to abstain and then offered a choice? Nicotine gum or a nicotine free cigarette? They always chose the nicotine free cigarette. They craved the smoke, not the nicotine. The research should have started there. It didn't. Instead, propaganda took hold. Propaganda that nicotine is addictive and is, therefore, the enemy. Perhaps it was a useful message at the time, but it became dogma. And that dogma has stifled research and, I believe, it cost lives. Right, here's my evidence. I smoked for 42 years. I couldn't quit. I believed all that stuff about nicotine. So when I tried vaping, I used the highest level of nicotine. It worked. Mm. So I stayed on a high level of nicotine. And then about 18 months after switching, I was attending this bonfire when I got a lung full of smoke. The effect was instant. Every cell in my body tingled and screamed, yes, 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 he's smoking again. Just to be clear, that was nothing to do with nicotine. My body was reacting to the smoke itself as if every cell was primed and waiting for that chemical punch of carbon monoxide, ammonia, all the rest. I suspect it would still be the case today. That's my smoking addiction. Here's my theory. Smoking is addictive because it's a double whammy. The chemical punch and the soothing nicotine. The chemical punch alone is actually unpleasant. Nicotine, just a mild stimulant, but put them together, chemical punch, soothing nicotine, chemical punch, soothing nicotine, it becomes a complete experience and one that is highly addictive. I've read so many studies that explain nicotine addiction. None match my experience. None can explain why nicotine is not addictive in NRT none look at the smoke. It's insane. A smoker draws that chemical soup deep into their lungs but that plays no role in the addiction. It is the addiction. This is so sad because of the dogma the medical treatment for smoking is NRT. But nicotine can't touch that craving for smoke. It's bound to fail. How many desperate smokers have tried and failed time and again because of that flawed dogma? Vaping works because it mimics the chemical punch. It's not perfect, but for many it's good enough and that's amazing. Nicotine is not addictive. It does not produce dependence. For many, like me, it's pleasant and beneficial and for some it's habit forming just like tea we're here because smoking is addictive but it's not the nicotine it's the smoke thanks for watching